Hello all, welcome back. In this second video, we will see the S2C module spin out. S2C has got total 20 pins of spacing 2mm and it has got a pigtail antenna on top. Pin 1 starts from left side if you place the arrow edge to the top and pin 10 is ground. Supply volt ranges from 2.6 to 3.6 volt DC. Typical supply volt is 3.3 volt. 5 volt will break your uh, module so be careful to use 3.3 volt or you need a uh, breakout board with the onboard 3.3 volt regulator P pin 2 is tx pin which is called d out and pin 3 is rx pin which is also called d in data received at pin 3 d in from a microcontroller is transmitted wirelessly and data received from a distant xb is spit out at pin 2 d out fourth pin acts as io12 or as a data output pin for SPI communication MISO pin 5 is reset which is low enabled yellow will uh, give a hard reset pin 6 has got uh, three functions IO 10 signal level RSSI indication and PWM 0 which is analog out 1 pin 7 is IO 11 and also PWM 1 pin 9 acts as IO 8 and also data terminal ready DTR and also sleep request pin in this pin 8 is not used it is reserved when pin 9 is pulled high uh, it will hibernate and it will go to sleep mode 1 other sleep modes are the sm4 and 5 cyclic sleep modes configured from uh, xctu pin 11 is io4 pin 12 and 16 acts as hardware flow control or handshake request to send rts and clear to send cts cts is pin 12 RTS is pin 16. It is used to reduce frame collisions used as handshake. Pin 14 is ADC that is V reference uh, which is usually 3.3 volt and pin 15 acts as associate pin for device sleep indication or status. Pin 17 to 20 is a data IO the DAO 3 2 1 and 0 also analog inputs ad3 ad2 ad1 and ad0 pin 20 is a special pin and connecting a push button to ground which lacked as a commissioning button do is by default one and at pin 15 associate led is there so in future videos we will check out this commissioning pin